everybody. Today we are going to talk about the weather in French and this is a video in particular for Emma who is going to learn about the weather in French. Well, I took this picture from the internet so there are some pictures and then I put here and I hope you can see it. So I put here some expressions about the weather. Now, first of all, how do you ask in French about the weather? So, first question. Quel temps fait-il aujourd'hui? It's like, what and, 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 and weather, well, I should start with the beginning. Weather in French is le temps. You see it here? Le temps, the weather. Or you can also say la météo. Le temps, la météo. Yes, and le temps, it's the time, but it's also the weather. Okay? So, we can ask the question, Quel temps fait-il aujourd'hui? What weather is it? And you, we will see later that quite often in French, you use the verb faire for the weather. Faire. Is it doing? Of course, this is not a, a, a good translation, but... Um, which weather is it making today? Quel temps fait-il aujourd'hui? And then the, the answer to that question will be, I have it here, il fait froid, so it is cold. And again, we use this il fait, which is rather the verb to do, but you use it for the weather. Il fait froid, il fait chaud, il fait gris, il fait nuageux. We will go through those. You can also ask the question, que dit la météo pour le weekend? What says the forecast, la météo, for the weekend? Que dit la météo pour le weekend? Okay, well, um, I think those two questions are important. And then, we have two constructions, or we are going to say il y a, there is. There is a lot of sun, there is wind, uh, there is, uh, well, I see that I took two times the same. I'm just going to take it away. Uh, there is a lot of rain, there is snow, and so on. So there is il y a. Then we have, for it's more like the sensation you have, you have a sensation of cold, you will say il fait. It's doing. But this is not, I know, this is not the right translation, but it's like, it is cold. So let's say that il y a is there is, and il fait, it is. Right? For the weather, it is. Okay? And then I have, <clears throat> sorry, haven't had my coffee yet, because I'm not home. Il gèle, it's freezing. Il pleut, it's raining. Il neige, it's snowing. And so, il gèle, it's the verb to freeze, geler. Il pleut is the verb pleuvoir. And il neige is the verb neiger. And what I will do at the end, uh, when I've gone through all those examples, I will put... Um, those verbs also in the past tense, so that you can conjugate them. Good. So, il y a du soleil. There is sun. Il y a du brouillard. There is mist, fog. Il y a un arc-en-ciel. Un arc-en-ciel, there is a rainbow. Il y a des nuages. There are clouds. Il y a du verglas. There is ice on the road. And, well, before I go further, at the end, I will do a small exercise just to see if you can put a sentence on each picture. But that we will do at the end. So, il y a du vent. There is wind. You can also say, il y a beaucoup de vent. There is a lot of wind. Il y a de l'orage. There is storm. Il y a des éclaircies. Des éclaircies, it's clearings. So the sky is clearing up. Des éclaircies. Il y a de la pluie. 
There is rain. Il y a de la neige. There is snow. Okay, so this construction, il y a, not so difficult, but then you use this um, undetermined article. Du, de la, un, one. Okay, good. Then we have all those let's say, sensations, or we will translate, it is, it is cold. Um, il fait froid. And now watch out, because later maybe you will learn to say, I am cold. So it's, I, I'm cold, I'm easily cold. And that will be, j'ai froid. That's the person feeling the cold, it's j'ai. J'ai froid, j'ai chaud. But that is not about the weather, right? It is cold, il fait froid. It is warm, il fait chaud. It's grey, but that's really a very Belgian thing because it's very often grey. Il fait gris. Il fait nuageux, cloudy. The E at the end is like cloudy, it's like the E at the end, it's cloudy. Il fait orageux. Um, well, how could we say that it's very stormy, is a storm coming? Orageux. Il fait ensoleillé, sunny, sunshine, because we see the word soleil in it, which is sun. Il fait brumeux, brumeux is foggy. Il fait humide, which is, well, humid, wet, humid. It's quite humid in Belgium. Il fait 12 degrés. It is 12 degrees. Il fait pluvieux. Pluvieux, that comes from the word pluie, rain, pluvieux, rainy, pluvieux. And then we can also put um, mon parapluie, my umbrella, which really says para, which is against the rain, para, pluie, right? Parapluie, it's my umbrella. Okay, il fait sec, it's dry. Il fait beau. Oh, beautiful weather. Il fait beau. Il fait mauvais. Bad weather. Look how bad the weather is. Il fait mauvais. Okay, so I hope those are clear. Then I have the three verbs. Il gèle, il pleut, il neige. Now, if I want, well, I'm sorry, if I want to say yesterday, it was freezing. Hier, il a gelé. It has frozen. Il a gelé. Hier, yesterday, it rained. Il a plu. It rained. Uh, yesterday, it was snowing. Hier, il a neigé. Okay. So this is the past perfect of those three verbs. Good. Now, what happens if you want to say yesterday there was snow? So the present tense is il y a, and then the past tense will be il y avait. Il y avait du soleil. There was sunshine. Il y avait du soleil. Now, you will say, why do I use here the simple past and here the Past perfect. Well, that will be explained in another video, but it's basically because here you have a description. You're describing the weather. Here it's more like an action. You could you could ask what happened. And here you would rather ask how was it? Il y avait. Okay? Il y avait du soleil, il y avait du brouillard, il y avait un arc-en-ciel, il y avait etc. etc. Um if you want to put il fait in the past tense, it's also an um, imparfait, so simple, a simple past, that will be il faisait. Il faisait. Il faisait froid, il faisait chaud, il faisait gris, il faisait nuageux, il faisait orageux, etc. etc. Okay, and then, but this is not as I explained really about the weather. It's like, how are you feeling? J'ai froid, j'ai chaud. That will become in the 
um, in the simple past, j'avais. I had it cold. I had it. J'avais froid. Hier, j'avais froid. Yesterday, I was cold. Okay, I hope this helped you a little bit, dear Emma. And now we're going to look at the pictures and we're going to try to put a sentence uh, a sentence on each picture. Now, this one here, I would say, il y a du soleil. Il y a beaucoup de soleil. Um, il fait ensoleillé. It is sunny. This one here, I would say, um, il y a des nuages, there are clouds, or it could be clearings, il y a des éclaircies, that's, that's, I think, the most, the, the best one, il y a des éclaircies, this one here, this is only cloudy, it's grey, il fait gris, il y a des nuages, Okay, what do you guys think of this one? I think it means it's freezing. Il gèle. It's freezing. Il gèle. Now, let me go down now and then I just go to the other side later. What do you guys think about this one? I would say it's cold because you see the, the temperature. So now if we say it is minus 5, you would say il fait Moins 5. And if you have minus, you don't put degré. You don't put degrees. You say, il fait moins 5. Il fait froid. Il gèle. Il y a du verglas. There is ice. Okay. This one, I think it's wind. May, oh no, this one is probably wind, windy. And this one is a storm. Il y a un orage. There is a storm. Or, il fait orageux. Il fait orageux. Il y a du vent. There is wind. Il fait venteux. It's windy. Uh, this one, I think it's a snowman. And then you have the sun. So, il y a du soleil. Il fait froid. Ah, maybe it has snowed. <coughs> Sorry, il a neigé. If there is a snowman. Well, il a neigé. Il a neigé. Oh, regarde. Il y a un arc-en-ciel. A rainbow. Uh, this one, il fait chaud. Il y a du soleil. Il fait beau. The weather is nice. Il fait beau. Uh, this one, I don't know what it is. I don't know. If you know, please... Um, uh, write it in the comments because I don't see what it is. This man here, he's just, he's, you know, there is like ice on the road and he's falling, he's gliding. Um, il gèle. Il y a du verglas. And um, it's slippery. We could say um, ça glisse. Maybe I could write it here. Ça glisse. It, it's like, it's, it's gliding. It's slippery. Let me put it at the end of the list. Ça glisse. Ooh, ça glisse. It's, it's slippery. Ça glisse. Um, this one, I think it's a storm. Il y a un orage. Yeah. And you see it even here. Il y a un orage. Uh, this, I think, is the fog. Il y a du brouillard. Il fait brumeux. This one, it's raining. Il pleut. Il fait pluvieux. Uh, this one, I'm not sure. We could say il pleut. But also, il y a des éclaircies. Clearings. Okay. So, I went through all the pictures. So, if you still have questions for me, you can just write them underneath this video or you can send me an email maybe miss a can help you at gmail.com yes that's my address so if you have a question you can ask it or you can make any suggestions for other videos success